if you are here, you are either here because you know me and you're thinking, she finally started a freaking channel. Or you're thinking, oh my God, she actually started a channel. Well, I did. <laughs> For those of you who don't know me, my name is Summer. Uh, <laughs> I know you're looking at my name and you're like, your name isn't Summer. Well, guess what, sister? My mother pushed me out of her body and then my parents looked at each other and were like, how can we ruin this girl's life? And then they decided to name me Summer, but spell it S-A-M-M-A-R. Summer with A's. Summer with A's. You know how many times I've had to say it's Summer with A's? There's one good thing about having a unique name like that, and it's that I have developed a fairly thick skin growing up, so much so that I got the reputation of Sass Master when I was in high school. Thank you to my grade 11 English teacher, Mrs. Segedin. I freaking love Miss Segedin. So here we are. You're probably wondering, why are you so special that you think you can have a YouTube channel? Well, guys, honestly, sorry to break it to you like this, but there is literally nothing that's special about me. The things that I've been reading are telling me to figure out like, are you, like, what is your talent? What are you coming on YouTube for? I am not overly talented at anything. I am not funny. <laughs> There's a lot of that. I'm not a comedian. I'm definitely not a comedian, but for some reason on my Instagram, people find it funny or entertaining that I'm really, really blunt and honest about a lot of things. I've been encouraged by a lot of people to start a YouTube channel, so here we are. This is my first YouTube video. I'm basically here to like tell a couple stories. I don't know, like, you know what? I don't know what I'm doing, I really don't. But at the end of the day, this is something that I wanted to do for a really freaking long time. Literally the hardest part about this thing is gonna be me trying to get used to look at this camera and not the freaking mirror image. I have no idea what I'm doing. For those of you people who don't know who I am, I am so thankful you found my video. I'm probably gonna do some videos like this where I just sit and talk to you guys about what's going on in my life because for some reason there's a lot of ridiculous things that happen to me. For example, I'll give you guys the little lowdown of literally why I started a YouTube channel. I woke up like, I don't know, four months ago with a giant bump on my eye. I'm wearing makeup so you can't really see it that well, but guys, there's a friggin' bump. Do you see it? I go to the doctor. He's like, it's a sty. Here's an antibiotic. It'll be gone in two weeks. Y'all should have seen how big this thing got. Now I've been freaking doing hot compress. It actually looks a lot better than it did guys, but I'm telling you, I look like I had a set of eyeball growing on my eyeball. I have been through the ringer. I have seen three different doctors. And finally, I have surgery on September 11th. So you know my ass is gonna have someone in that room. They are gonna cut their, first of all, they're gonna freaking freeze my eyelid. Then they're gonna flip her over and then they're gonna poke a hole in it and see if it's liquid. If it's liquid, they're gonna drain it out. If it's not liquid, they're gonna cut it open more and they're gonna scoop out the freaking cyst that's in my eye and I'm probably gonna get to take it home. If that sounds like something interesting or entertaining for you to watch, if you are like one of those weird ass pimple popper enjoyer people, you definitely wanna to subscribe to my channel because I'm gonna upload one of those videos and it's gonna be, I'm gonna try and get someone to get right in there. I feel like it would make great YouTube content. What else can I talk to you guys about? Oh, something I wanted to post on my Instagram, but I was saving it for my first YouTube video so you guys can kind of get a glimpse of like what I usually talk about. I made a delicious protein smoothie this morning. It looked scrumptious. I put a straw in it, guys. I take a sip, I immediately feel something in my mouth. I'm not like a gross person. Like I get really grossed out when people spit on the ground or like pick their nose. Like, like yeah, everyone picks their nose, but like you don't need to pick your nose in front of me. Do you know what I'm saying? So anyway, I take a sip and I feel it and it tastes almost, it was almost like there was like a jelly, I don't even know, I don't know, but it was really gross and my immediate instinct was to be like, Bleh! spit it out as fast as you can, abort, abort. I spit it out on the ground in the kitchen and when I looked down at it, it was a freaking earwig, an earwig. Do you know what an earwig is? You know those black and red beetle looking things that are kind of skinny and they like, and then they got freaking claws at the back of them. I had an earwig in my mouth. Immediately I was like, I put this shit through the blender. How did that thing survive? How is it? How is it? And I realized it was in the straw when I went to drink it. I, it was in my mouth. I'm not okay. It was really bad. It was really bad. It brought me back to this memory that I have as a child. I had one of those great like Crayola desks and they had the spots where you could put juice boxes and like, you know? I remember one day I was just coloring, coloring or doing necklaces or, and I took a drink, I grabbed my juice box 
and I pulled the juice box away from my mouth and the string of old ass jelly juice was down my throat and I was like Ugh. guys these are things like I honestly I still think about that if I can't I smell fruit punch juice boxes by what is it dole I cannot even like my little brother drinks one I'm like stay away from me that shit traumatized me that's like exactly what I thought of and it literally ruined it ruined my morning you guys I get grossed out really eat this one time I went on a date with a guy and he was so cute and so charming and great and we were like walking along the river holding hands it was so romantic and he was like I'm sorry I'm sorry give me a sec I'm like oh, okay like whatever you need he turns around he's like what? and spits on the ground I literally was like <sighs> and he's like are you okay I'm like no do I look okay you just horked a loogie in front of me game friggin over you want to make me not your friend Work a loogie in front of me and it'll be over. I guess that's my storytelling for today. If you have made it this far and you kind of enjoy what I do here, I encourage you to like and subscribe to my channel. If you guys have any ideas or videos or like I might do a Q&A video so you guys can get to know me better, um, but I need you guys to comment and let me know what you guys think or shoot me an email or follow me on Instagram and shoot me a DM. Literally whatever you want. Um, that's it. I think that's it. That's my first vlog ever, guys. I did it. And I'm very amateur and I'm sorry that I'm so amateur, but I'm trying. And I really, really want to do this and I want to do a good job. I really want to do this. So I appreciate your support. If I make one of you guys happy or one of you guys smile or one of you guys have a feeling about me like, oh my God, this girl's such an idiot. If that's what you get from my channel, subscribe.